here to watch Breaking Bad, Yay. season five, episode 14. We are very close to the end. Oh my God, it's two episodes away. I'm kind of freaking out. I don't know, man. Like, so like I was thinking about it. It's been quite the journey now. And like, I don't want to see anybody die, not even Walt. Like, I know he's like in pickle now, obviously. But yeah. now it's like, oh crap. It's like, the thing you, you, you root for, but then when it happens, you're like, oh no. And it's one of those things where I, part of the reason why I love this show is how complicated they write their characters. And it really is a look at what it means to be human. Because I think especially in today's society, you know, there's this prevalence of cancel culture. Yeah. But yeah. that really, robs humans of self-determinism, of their ability to evolve. Yeah, and that's and, what like, I feel like Walter's struggling with, too. Yeah, it's just like, I remember, don't get me wrong, like, Walt, I think from the beginning, has a lot of issues that he kind of masked under this false stoicism that kind of prevented him from healing the wounds in himself and... They've, they've essentially become, you know, infected in a way. Yeah. And I understand his cancer's back, so right now he couldn't really have the opportunity to, I guess, heal from them, even if he wanted to. <clears throat> but there was a point where Walt could have been somebody different, and I think that person still exists. There's going to be blood on his hands no matter what, but we get to see him as... At least in moments, and I want to believe that they're genuine when he's a, a loving father oh, and a loving yeah. husband. Oh, but I, yeah. I don't, I don't know. know anymore. He could have put it into this a long time ago, but again, he evolved into this kind yeah. of thing. So, so. It'll be interesting to see how this ends. But yeah, I feel bad now. Like I don't want to root for his death anymore. I feel just like ah crap, he's he's been captured. Yeah. yeah. So it's like who, who knows what's gonna they're come of this though? Because. Yeah. The, the last thing we saw was that shootout. Yeah. 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 And, and um, one thing somebody in the comments wrote is, to, and it, it, I, I too many times notice it, but like, it really shows how much Walt actually cares for Hank because he was willing to go to jail over this situation. Like yeah. he's like, take me. He's like, fuck it. So, so. I mean, do you have a choice anymore? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, True. But I'm worried. I, I, I really, really hope Hank survives this. All right, y'all, let's get this show on the road. Remember, guys, this is not a market substitute for the actual Breaking Bad episode. Please check this out on your own personal record. You can go ahead and watch it on Netflix. Buy the Blu-ray, support the OG, OG version. Check out our Patreon. We are a bunch of episodes ahead. Our, actually, yeah, the finale's up there, basically, in our uncut. So check that out. Um, check out our merch, our gaming channel. All the links are in the description. Let's get this show on the road. I'm not ready. I'm not either. Mm. Yo, so. Oh my god! What's next? Throwback Thursday. Look down. It says I'm not doing the receipts right. Oh, he's got a bug up his butt. He's got a stick up his butt. He's insisting that I. He's demanding that I stay. Wow, there was a time when he had to think about his lies. It seems so natural now. Mm. Man, Hello? they they filmed right, this back right, then too, right. so knowing mm -hmm. all the. Oh my um, god! Yeah. Jesse looks. I was about to comment on that. He looks as old as you right now. Say I'm sorry, but I'm gonna be late tonight. Bogdan, he's got a bug up his butt. Oh, that's okay. I wasn't planning anything special for dinner, so. She never even asked where he was. What was he doing? Hey, what do you think about Holly for the baby's name? I think I really like it. Holly. Yeah, it's nice. Why don't you call me uh, when you're on your way home, okay? Will do. Love you. Love you, too. Oh, they're so cute. I knew it was going to disappear. <laughs> and that is the spot of the shootout. Please don't let Hank die. So is Walt running from the Nazis then? We still don't have a clear on that. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Fuck. Uh-uh. Wait, I know they're dead, right? Oh, that was a really cool transition, but that, oof. Go me, Hank, Jesse. <gasps> oh. Oh, 
that's bad. That's really bad. Gomez is dead as fuck. Gomez is dead as fuck. No, 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 no. Fuck. Oh, simmer down there, Sparky. Fuck, 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 fuck. These guys are DEA. Bro, go stop this now. Go kill him. Back it up. Come on, come on. Go kill him. Get back. The hell not, he's DEA. No, he's he's family. He's my family. He's my brother-in-law. Hank, nothing can change what just happened. But you can walk out of here alive if you just promise us that you'll you'll let this go. No, bro, please yeah, say Hank. Uh, just no scenario where this guy lives. No, 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 listen! High money! It's buried out here. It's Eighty million dollars. Wow, you can lie a little. You can have any future that you want, and all you've got to do is let him go. That's a hell of an offer. What do you think, Fred? Would you take that deal? It's Hank. His name is Hank. How about it, Hank? Should I let you go? My name is Asak Schrader. You can go fuck yourself. You gotta tell him now that we can work this out. Please, please. You want me to beg? You're the smartest guy I ever met. And you're too stupid to see. He made up his mind 10 minutes ago. Do what you're gonna do. Pretty specific directions. Most people tell me to be somewhere, they say west on the 40, this or that exit. This is a whole other story. That fancy phone of yours, where does it say this is exactly? Just go and kill your brother and take the money anyway. Damn, man. Doing fucking business for the Oh, my God. No, man. All that fucking yeah. work. No fucking way. And they're gonna put him in the hole where his fucking money was. Dirty. I'm leaving you a barrel. The boys are gonna load it for you. Sorry for your loss. Shut the fuck up. Pinkman, you still owe me. If you can find him, we'll kill him. Found him. Style. Good to go? Hey, Uncle Jack. He had to have told him some stuff that might not be too good for us. I and mean, I bet we could get it out of him back home. It's, what's Todd doing? And then, you know, we take care of the job after that. Work for me. Work for you. Mm. Let's go. Oh. No. 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 Wait. <laughs> I watched Jane die. <gasps> oh my fucking what? I watched her overdose and choke to death. I could have saved her, but I didn't. They're still like, this is just the opening. I feel like it's been an hour. What's he gonna tell Marie? Same mm -hmm. time around, you notice so many things, fuck. Like, you know where he's buried, bro. There ain't no skew, Pinkman. Marie knows that you got him. Yeah, oh my god, yeah. She's expecting her husband to come home. She's expecting you to call that he arrested him. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because he, like, rushed over, remember? I figured maybe his engine took a bullet. Oh, no, you're right. Was it a bullet? It was leaking on Jesse's face. You're right. And you got a barrel of money. Just gonna do call triple A.
like, just for this episode, I said I feel bad for him and shit. Yep. Dude, come on, man. What kind of, like, roller coaster does he put me through every fucking season? Does that truck belong to you? I'd like to buy it. It's not for sale. Marie, I haven't seen you for a while. What have you been up to? Your mom and I need to talk, so. Well, I uh, wish you'd called first. This isn't the best time. Well, Flynn looks like he can hold down the fort. And Marie, I think, is a bigger person than I am, because I would be looking at, Walt, like, Walt Jr. and being like, your dad's a fucking meth dealer. Get in the car. <laughs> Let's go home. Yeah. He arrested Walt three hours ago. Hank is booking Walt as we speak, and I, for one, could not be happier. All I know, all I have been forcing myself to remember is that you are my sister and so i'm here everything changes now and you have got to prepare yourself oh my god this so bad i want you to give me every single copy of that obscenity that the two of you made to discredit hank that dvd answer me do you understand me yes now dry your eyes and get flynn in here because you are going to tell him everything and i mean everything skyler he deserves to know the truth no he cannot no you tell him or i will well there goes the armory Yeah, man. Uh, they fucked him up, though. Look, okay, they gave me what you wanted. Come on, Fanny, please. Hey, hey, just, oh just, just go. <laughs> Are you gonna cook for them? Nah, no, they're gonna kill him. No, he knows the recipe. Right? He knows the fucking recipe. Are you shitting me? Is that why Todd kept him alive? Todd? Yes! Todd's a smart cookie. Oh, you calculated fucking creep. I'm just... Oh my god, they have like a slave. They showed him what's up. Like, alright, now you're gonna cook. If not, we'll just be doing this shit to you again. Oh, and they did. They fucked him up. Yeah, homie, you're on a leash. <laughs> This is bullshit. This is bullshit. I, I want to talk to dad. Your dad's in custody. You won't be able to talk to him for a while. So I, I'm, I'm calling Uncle Hank. He's not answering. Uh, he's he's in the thick of it with your father. Try to breathe. Really? And just really? trust that Try it's... to breathe. He handled that better than I thought he would. Uh, uh, uh. You ever see a dead car that just like collapse? I mean, like, isn't nobody after you now? Is that Flynn's stuff? And Holly's. Yeah. Cause They're not going with you. Fucking Nazis. Whose truck is that? Dad? I need you to come inside and pack right now. Aunt Marie, they, they, they said that you were arrested? No, just, just, okay, just, just tell listen me what? to me. Just listen to me. I need you to go into your bedroom right now and grab anything that's important. Do you understand? Why are you here? Hank had you in custody. He wouldn't just let you go. Where is he? I negotiated. Negotiated? Uh, yes. What does that mean? It means everything is going to be fine, but we need to leave right now. All right? Can we do that? What happened? Where is Hank? Please just work with me here, and I promise I will explain everything later. Where is Hank? I have $11 million dollars in cash right outside. We can have a fresh start. You killed him. Oh, my God. No, no, no. You killed him. Hank. What? No, 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 no! I tried to save him! Uncle Hank is dead. I, no, no. I, and Mom, it, it can't be Stop, true. Please, it just please. can't be true. Everything, everything's gonna be fine. I promise you what we need to leave right now. Dad, what, what's going on? Talk to me. There is no time. Hurry around, Uncle Hank. This bitch is not about to fucking stab somebody in front of, like... To Uncle Hank. What? Get out. Skylar, I promise you, we will figure this out. Enough. Skylar, put the knife down, please. Ooh. Hi, oh, yeah. Ooh. Oh, no, no. Oh, One more word. 
Get out of here. Now. First of all, that's not how you hold the knife. Get out! Oh. Oh. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Killed somebody. We're at 308 Negro Arroyo Lane. 308 Negro Arroyo. No! 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 Oh, please, no! 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 You're gonna be dead in like six months anyways. What the fuck are you gonna do with your baby? Please, no! What? Please! Good luck, Dustin, editing this shit. Like... Confirming the abduction. Amber alert. Holly White. Use me handcuffs. Hey, Adam. I'm gonna trace on a landline. Skyler. 505. Walt, where's Holly? Are you alone? Walt! What the hell is wrong with you? Why can't you do one thing I say? What? This is your fault. This is what comes of your disrespect. I warned you for a solid year. You cross me, there will be consequences. You took my child. Because you need to learn. You were never grateful for anything I did for this family. You have to stop this. It's immoral. It's illegal. Someone might get hurt. Fuck everything I said earlier. Now you tell my son what I do after I've told you and told you to keep your damn mouth shut. You stupid bitch. Oh, what, what the hell do you know about it anyway? Nothing. I built this. Me, me alone. Nobody else. You're right. You mark my words, Skylar. Toe the line or you will wind up just like <gasps> Hank. Tell me what happened. Where is Hank? You're never gonna see Hank again. He crushed me. Oh. Oh. Family or no, you let that sink in. I just want Holly back. Just come home. I've still got things left to do. talk to me for like three more minutes. Was it like even a moment of break in this episode? No. They fucked us. So this, they said that, I don't know, I, I, I've been told about this was like the best hour of television in all of like TV history. Yeah. This is what this episode is known as. Yeah. Can I tell you guys a couple of parallels that I noticed in this episode that I didn't see? I mean, just you guys go. Just say what you gotta say. You expect me to talk about All this right, right now? <laughs> okay, I'll just start. So, like, one of the biggest parallels I noticed in this uh, episode that I, on the rewatch that I noticed, so when um, they shot Hank, the way Walt reacted was the same way Gus reacted when Gus's brother died. He fell out like that, and he fell to the side like that, and, and the same and way he, he cried, brain, he watched, yeah, mm-hmm. same exact manner. And I noticed it for the first time, I was like, oh, wow, that is just, this show is just, like, so good at showing those little things. And also, so when he was, like, pushing his barrel across the desert, you know that pair of pants you guys saw? That was from the first episode. But I found, that, I found out about that, like, 
later on. For, but uh, yeah, anything you guys want to say? I know like this was hard. This is a really hard episode. Trust me, it was very very hard to watch. I don't get here. why like on the phone he's talking to Skylar and he's like, can you just fucking tell the truth? What happened? Yeah, like why well, are you admitting because, that okay, he did it? Like I, mean, I don't get it. Like, are you trying to intimidate her and shit? But like it's to get the 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 guilt off of her. Oh, it's it was all me. Yeah. All me. It was all me. I put you through this, bitch. And I then when she you. said sorry, she was like saying, like. Okay. I thought you I thought you caught on, caught, caught on to that when you were like I take back everything I said about Walt. No, she means like the good thing. Uh, yeah, I mean you I weren't just, there for an introduction. Oh okay. I just. <sighs> no, I get down. Be slow. I, I like I, I, uh, fuck, and like you know, like I mean, at the end of the day, you know, he 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 did this all because his of his family. And like I noticed, like when when he like when um, Junior and and Scott were on the floor, he's like, "We're family, we're family." Like he kept like repeating that, like this was all like since the plan since the beginning was for them. All together and in it together, and like he was like, let's go, let's go. And they weren't gonna go with him, so he was gonna make himself the ultimate villain. And that just sucks. And now that she's out there, he's taken the blame for Hank's death. He's threatened her with the same. She's going to the police. This is gonna put her into witness protection. Let's just let's, let's, let's backtrack to the beginning of the episode. Man, what, Hank, R.I.P. Yeah, R. I. P. yeah. I, I, I mean, I didn't. I, I there was a. There was a hope in me that, like, you know, he was going to get away with you know, living, you know, because he already, so many times has he, like, you know, brushed with, you know, death and whatnot, but, like. If anything, I feel like rewatching this, I, like, forgot, like, the way the events took place. Like, I remember the whole money situation, but I just completely forgot that, like, he put that out there first. It was like, I have this. It's just, it. Yeah, and it's like, all, all things aside, don't tell him it's in the fucking desert. It's the, the the part, man, that got to me the most was when Hank was like, you're the smartest man in the world, Hank, the smartest man I know in the world. It was just not soon enough to tell that he made a decision 10 minutes ago. Yeah. You're just like, oh my God. There was no, I mean, he came out, he killed a DEA agent. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, there was no was walking away from that. The, Poor Gomez, too, Gomi. Gomi. The amount of, like, the dude, just. The, man. I mean, yeah. Fucking like, Gomi. At the end of it, he was like, I'm ASAC Schrader. <laughs> like, yeah. Dude, Hank went out like with his fucking boots. What the dude? That's you know. At least he knew, and then he was right. In the from the beginning to end, it has been amazing to watch Hank's character develop. Dude, yeah, I hated Just, him so much, but no, oh. Because in the beginning, you know, he said some not so PC things. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna lie. I feel like it was more PC not to us because like we things are a little bit different now than it was back then. I feel like I don't know. Whatever. And I will say, Marquetta, I think, did make a really good point about that as as police culture overall because it's like overall the pedagogy within that yeah. is not to go off on a, on a don't get me wrong I'm not saying anything they said was okay yeah. but the extent that they went they, that they would go to to desensitize and dehumanize people for the which is one of the problems within our police force that needs to be like looked at and, mm-hmm. and worked on by all means but I think Marquetta did make a really good point about why they are the way they are. Yeah. But again, Hank evolved beyond that. Yeah, he really did. Like, just his, just the way, I mean, at the end of the day, he solved the mystery. But the mystery cost him his life. Yeah, and it it's really just did. like he it, chased it the sucks. story for too long. He, he chased it for so long, and it was right there. And the thing about it, Hank was always right, and he knew he was right. Yeah, no, I know. I, I, just, I, I just love the way he went from, like, the Hank... I couldn't walk with anything. He was fucking collecting minerals to like <laughs> now. Hank, I love you so much. I just need to lay on the floor and count to twenty. Oh, <laughs> like, bro, that scene was like, well, Jesse Pinkman, right there. I'm oh, like, I yeah. know. He fucking told him. Yeah, how do you guys feel about that? One? I, I was really waiting for that reaction. I wish they just killed him right then and there, knowing what they're doing with him now. And I and, mean, and then like he's like, I watched Shane die. I don't want to. I was like, you. Yeah, like the, the wound is open. He's like salt. You're salt, babe. You're salting that shit. You're like, like. I mean, I swear, I if, if Jesse, salt. if Jesse somehow escapes this and someday sees Walt again, you know he's gonna fuck him up. I, if, if Walt can make it through the next two episodes, I don't know 
what the fuck is going to happen? Uh, and Walt, obviously, he has nothing behind him anymore except $11 million, and he can't go fuck up the people that killed Hank. Like, you, yeah. you are no longer Heisenberg. You well, are, he bought you a new fell, life. Yeah, he bought a new life. He fell from grace. Yeah. You're done, buddy. It's, it, it, it sucks, man. It man, sucks. all that money be taken away from him, too. Like, that was, like, the whole reason why he's in that situation was because of that money and his ego and everything else, obviously. But, but was that money, and now it's gone. Yeah, his yeah. family is going to have... Well, I mean, I guess they have the car wash, which is cool. Yeah. But if that was bought with drug money, is that going to be taken too? I think so. I, you, I think that would be subject for. Uh, yeah, to be yeah. investigated. And stuff. How, how'd you guys feel about that whole scene with Marie and and, uh, and Skyler? Like, the nothing about horrible room, for Marie. That Ted City in that room was out of this world, and like, yeah. like forcing fucking Junior to come in and be like, "Yo, we need to tell him now." Like, and it's like as somebody with two sisters so I, i'm the middle brat i've yeah. got an older sister who's a couple years older than me and a younger who's like how old is she she's like three years younger than you no because i'm gonna be 25 this year and Four she's years. 18 so do the math i can't right oh, now never mind. she's like six years younger than you <laughs> um i and we have gotten into our fights as a family like we we've, we've gone through it and we've come out the other side like i know what it took for Marie, the difficulty she had to go in, to, to go into that room and see her, but the love she must have felt for her to do it in the first place anyway. The stuff you do for your family, like even this, like, the, whatever, like in that kind of situation with like a friend or, or another kind of person, like fuck you. Yeah. But since it's family, like. I mean, that hit yeah. me. Like, yeah. all I know is that you're my sister. Yeah. And like. I mean, and fucking poor Junior. Yeah, I, I love how they like they just like cut in on him like already knowing the news and like what well, you guys are lying to me. Just, <laughs> just just very, shit. It is very it's so good. It's just like cinematography. He's like, which lie is the lie? This lie or that lie? Like, like just, oh god. And RJ made his world. RJ made like knocked that shit out of the park, man. You know what I mean? I mean like, so because yeah. that because like the, the actor himself has not been around that aspect of the show at all whatsoever. You know what I mean? This is the first time him actually. Did, Having this subject the last three episodes, it's just, I felt like that was kind of like his his acting was like top notch on that. Oh yeah, I mean, I so think he's well done a really done. great job this, this, this whole, entire us, season. Yeah, um, the way he protected like Skyler too. I'm like, damn. Yeah, like, that, he, that, he really stepped he up. He called the cops on his phone. He really yeah. stepped up. Yeah, he really stepped up because like he's all upset. He was about his dad. Like, no, you're lying. My dad. Like his dad's like, you know, your hero and stuff like that. And for him to like call the police, that took so much out of him. Because again, that is family. You got you can sit there and try to talk it out or whatever. But like, he took the, the like the, the ultimate move. He, yeah, he's got a, a strong ass moral compass. He knows yeah. what's right, and that. I mean, could you imagine? Like, could you imagine your your mom and aunt coming to you and being like, "Hey." So, your dad has murdered, like, we don't even know how many people, and also manufactures a highly illegal and highly addictive substance, and I understand why he started it in the first place, but now he just kind of, like, does it for shits and giggles. <laughs> shits and giggles. So, yeah. 80 million cash. Oh, That's shit. so bad. Fucking, and I swear to God, I swear to fucking God. If these goddamn Nazis, I need some fucking Tar Quentin Tarantino style fucking Nazi scalps. I just maybe maybe Jesse with like some ingredients will blow them all up. Uh, I mean, right I, now, right now. Yeah. So, uh, uh, one thing I want. What is your opinion about oh, Todd? Because Todd, Todd like, I'm not gonna lie. He's a smart cookie. Just, just, just the way he like, is. He's Move. an asshole. He's an asshole, and he's dirty and everything. But he can really just. Let's put a button in that really quick. Yeah. Do you remember in season one when Walt mixed those chemicals when Crazy Eight and Emilio were in the van? <gasps> oh yeah. And he uh. Those fumes and everything made them call. Yes. Like, Let's not forget. Okay, he has a way out. Maybe. I'll if he was fucking it. paying attention, he yeah, has a way yeah. out. If he is. But Todd, yes, calculated, cold. Like the fact that he's like that cold and calculated is just really just like shows you what kind of crazy he is. Like yeah, because like I mean it's just like the way he's like so maybe we should keep him for a bit, shouldn't we, uncle? And then, and, and then maybe after we finish. Like he's all, he, he's like he's like the way he brings you know, the conversation. Like, Walt thinks of lies right on the spot. He did it right then and there. He's, he's a psycho. Yeah, I mean honestly, like I think I really underestimated 
him when he was first introduced because I, 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 I just pegged him as a yes man, and those are dangerous. But he know he knows how to how to play the fucking game. Yeah, not scary for somebody like that. Yeah, I mean that to. The, the, oh, just, the amount of torture he put. I know. It, Jesse's face is so. Uh, they cut fucked. his face up, right? I, I just. The one thing that was so well done, I feel like, is like he just let Jesse in the room, let Jesse go. Didn't even say anything to Jesse. And just like Jesse kept walking forward and he sees a picture and then automatically goes, all right, let's get to work. Like, yeah. he like he just. Knows. He's. You're going to make a friend in Jesse. He's going to try. He's like, well, we're now we're partners. Oh, he's like, yeah, we, we, we were pretty good together, you know? We were like. Just, Ugh, sadistic little fucker. Also, well, I, well, go no, on. No, 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 you don't. I was just going to say, I don't know if... Because was... He privy to the conversation where Jesse was, like, going in and calling him crazy for killing that kid? No, I don't think so. Okay. Because I don't know if, like, Jesse would be on a shit list for that. I don't even know if this guy has a shit list. Like, does he feel anything? No. He's psychopath. Yeah. Like, yeah, I genuinely right. believe, like... Clinically, fucking just. I. Psychopath. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Psychopath. I don't know. Skylar was cool too, though, in this episode. Just finally standing up and having a voice like, That's it, I'm done with your lies. I mean. That it. That Because, like, Junior asked her, he's like, why'd you go along with it? And this is where she's like, I'm not going to go along with it anymore. I, I've always, I always thought that last little bit. You know, where with Skylar and, and Holly was just like you could feel it from Walt's side of the you know game because he knows he's fucked up mm-hmm. and this is just this is it. He's just like he's, he's he's. God, Holly was so cute in this episode. Mama, mama, oh my god, oh my god. So my good. baby fever's been too bad it, for that it, episode. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, I saw that in my heart. Uh, no, no, no baby fever. This is this is always I've always felt like this is some of the greatest TV. It's like, you know, it's the kind of TV that makes you sit there and makes you feel uncomfortable, you know? Oh, I felt, it, like, honestly, yeah. my asshole was puppy that entire yeah. fucking, <laughs> that entire fucking episode. <laughs> or just like, what is trust, gonna trust happen? Trust me, trust me. And th- this is the kind of TV that I love for. The shit that makes you uncomfortable, the shit that puts you at the, the edge shits. of your, uh, puts you at the edge of your seat. This was too much for me. This whole episode, I was like, and it makes you think about it for days. Yeah. yeah. Literal Days. Yeah. days I'll on like days on, days. on the drive home. I'll be thinking, and I'll get home, and I'll be like, "Oh my god, Ben!" And I'm just like talking about it for a week after we. You've seen it episode. all, right? Yeah, I've yeah. Been yeah. Seen everything. Ben's probably just like, "Man, she don't know." Well, and that's, what's wild though is he remember everything I bring up. He remembers scene for scene. Yeah, because like Ben is how, it's, it's, Ben's like the smartest it's, person. It's you're you're, fucking, you're probably the second. Epic. Ben's the first. It's probably <laughs> pretty fucking. Epic. Like, <laughs> Yeah, Ben's the smartest I know. Like, fuck. well, I'm flattered to even be <laughs> yeah. compared to that. Yeah, Ben's just a the, goddamn like ben black hole of genius. Like, I feel like I, I think I even said to him one time. I was like, Brent, I feel like you're way too smart for your own good. Sometimes mm-hmm. I said to his face, he's like, ah, yeah. <laughs> you know, Ben. Yeah. He's like, I don't know how to take that, but yeah, man, I'm just gonna nod. <laughs> he and says, act like I know what to do. <laughs> we love Ben. We miss you, buddy. But thank you all for watching with us. We have two more episodes left. For all of you guys on Patreon, this will be double dropped. We'll see you guys in next week. And on some real shit, Thanks. we need to do a podcast. Yeah, we yeah, do. We will. We're we gonna do. do a podcast. Yeah, we do. Because I got a lot of feelings to unpack. A lot of us do. I'm feeling a lot of feelings. I'm feeling a lot of feelings. I don't even know what I'm thinking right, right now. Yeah. I kind of want to vomit. This is the best hour TV now. I, I, I truly get what they mean now. I, yeah. I get it. Fuck. All right, y'all. Peace. Bye. Bye. Thanks for watching Breaking Bad with the Normies. Only two more episodes left. Both are available on Patreon Early Access, and our uncut reactions to the entire series are available as well. Also, check out our live gaming channel, merchandise, and social links in the description. Shout out to Luis, Joe, Nasser, Marky, Chelsea, Gino, Adam, Kelly, Keyboard Junkie, NYR Fan, and Philip. and we'll see you next time.